I wanted to show you guys our, our extensibility. We're going to have a little fun with it. And this is the voice define WAN that we talked about. But first, remember I told you I don't want to click, 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 click all my sites and do all that? I don't want to do that. So Marcelo, one of the guys at, uh, at Riverbed, created a tool using REST API. How cool is that? So I'm going to show you in a video real quick how I can add 50 or more sites at a drop of a, um, so here it is. Or I kind of sped through this, so those are all my sites, and you can see, oh, sorry, 85 sites. I created a CSV file. It can be from your CMDB, ServiceNow. Save it to a CSV file that he's doing right there. This is the framework. This is the REST API. He just dragged and dropped it here, making of the sausage on the left, enjoying the sausage on the right. <laughs> this is all the stuff, gory stuff, that has to happen for you to automatically create, 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 create. We purposely put uh, duplicate names so you can see there, which is pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> right? Nice. Now, take it a step further. Remember that change control 2 a.m.? Who wants to do that? We are, as a society, good or bad, we're getting lazy. I don't even like to put the key in to a car to in unlock audience, it anymore. Right? That happened to me when I was in Iceland. Nothing against you folks in Iceland. Beautiful country, love it. But the rental car they gave me was a key. <clears throat> And I can't tell you how many times I got out of the car and I was like, oh, damn it. <laughs> so I'm lazy. I don't even want to get up at 2 a.m. to even click anything. So you see over there, what do we see? Amazon Echo. Play it. Steel Connect. Welcome to Steel Connect app for Amazon Echo. Add 388 Granite Street in New York, New York to the network. The site named 388 Grand Street has been successfully created in New York. Alexa, add a branch in Boston, Massachusetts. It actually made the branch. Yeah. Branch, Boston. Yeah. Alexa, add an alarm for 2 a.m. for change control. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. I'm sorry, Dave. I am afraid I can't do that. Let me explain to you what happened. As a joke, I asked Marcelo and Jordan, who's our uh, SC in uh, Sweden. He has an application background. So he took the time to create an uh, Alexa app. And all you could say is, Alexa, Steel Connect. And it goes into Steel Connect mode. Just like if, for those of you who know how to play Jeopardy on Alexa, it's just an app on Alexa. Okay, there you go. Love it. I love it. So once you put it into Alexa mode, it understands these keywords. Add this branch, add that branch, do this. And as a joke, I said, hey, when I say change control at 2 a.m., reply back with, I'm sorry, Dave, I can't do that. <laughs> turns out, turns out that's actually an Easter egg in Alexa. For those of you with Alexa at home, if you go and say, Alexa, open the pod bay doors, it'll come back with, sorry, Dave, can't do that. But I didn't know that that was an Easter egg that built in. Man, I couldn't even get Alexa to subnet a slash 22. It tried to order me a dollhouse. Like, I actually had. <laughs> <laughs> so, while it's funny, you saw the power of RESTful API. Imagine what you can do, right? And you saw the browser-based drag and drop. Okay, we made it that easy to onboard your entire organization with a single click. And the missing ingredient here, what's missing? Stupid human tricks. We all know, we're all guilty of it. We've typoed things as we're doing change control. I can't tell you one, there's an example where they dropped the zero in my rate limit command. And I'm off by order of magnitude, okay? And because there are no <laughs> comma separators or decimal separators, <laughs> it's hard to diff that at 2 a.m. So we've taken that human problem of the config is perfect, the human operator, not so perfect, especially when it's 2 a.m., 3 a.m., and I'm tired. We've taken that out, short-circuited it, and so I ask Brad, and Brad does it for me. Brad is SCM.